God. Guys, it was so it was such a so... cheaply made movie, and we're really afraid that that shit's gonna get Iron Giant. Oh, it's getting Iron Giant. It's guaranteed. Absolutely. <laughs> Fuck you, Jinx. Uh, for those for those of you that don't know, um, oh. Iron Iron oh. Giant is widely considered to be one of, if not like, it, I wouldn't say if not the, but it, it's definitely like <clears throat> top five considered by critics to be one of the, one of the best animated movies ever fucking made. Yeah. All right. It was. Like it, people oh. were floored when oh. Iron Giant came out, um, and not like I never knew this until the past like four years oh. when I just happened to be like Fuck. googling it. Um, but Iron Giant did horribly oh, awfully. at the box office. Awfully, just awfully. It, it did not in box office make up for cost, no. and that and, and like now it's it's like a of like a favorite. Like Iron Giant is yeah, it's one a cool of, classic for sure. Iron Giant oh, is better than, than any of the movies I've talked about to me. Like for like I I I like Iron Giant more than Kung Fu Panda. Like it's specifically because really? the place that Iron Giant has has for me like Damn. as a kid. Um, the mom's hot. I mean, I'll give you that. I right. I've watched so much porn with the mom. We all have. We all have. It's you. It's Jennifer <laughs> Aniston. Um, oh, fuck. Yeah. Good point. Yeah. I. Right. But if, if, great great fucking movie. Warner Brothers. I'm pretty sure it was Warner Brothers. Um, Warner Brothers thought that it was just gonna be whatever. Those they just didn't were... think it was gonna be very good. They probably thought it was gonna be good, but they thought they they thought it wasn't gonna make any money. That's that's. Well, that's point. what it was. Is they did they didn't think that it was the kind of movie that would make money. They didn't think sure. that I they either didn't think it was gonna be that good or they didn't think it was gonna be the kind of good that made money. Exactly. And so they just they didn't do shit. They did not fucking advertise it until a month before it came out. Ridiculous. A month before release, they tried to get a deal with Burger King. They tried to they tried to push through a deal with Burger King to start putting out Iron Giant uh, toys yeah. in their in their kids meals, and it, I th I can't remember if it was successful. I think I think they failed, but regardless, it happened a month before. It did horribly at the at the box office, and that that like still to this day, um, when like people will talk to executives of of Warner Brothers and uh, they will either be like just so feel so bad like they'll be like that yeah. that is genuinely one of the worst mistakes I've made as as a as at least exec. there's that at least at least uh, they feel bad about it or they're, they, oh. they'll be like they'll get really defensive <laughs> which is the biggest mark of them obviously knowing that they should not have done this absolutely um, god I, I love I love Iron Giant a lot I like I cried at it when I was a kid I still cried at it now um, I, I, it's got, I, I, it has some of the best reviews to ever be given to an animated movie. Jesus. Um. I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, dude, it was, it is, it's, it was, it was some real shit. Yeah. At the time. Um. It is definitely on par, critically, with Disney's greatest. Nice. Uh, and it, it was, it was just from Warner Brothers, and they just didn't think that they were going to put out anything like that. Um. It cost eighty million dollars. I think it made like sixty-five. Jeez. Or something. And but like w Ricky and I talk about this. Like, how can you how, like if something costs eighty million dollars? How could yeah? How can you? How not? how can you not be willing to spend another fucking five on marketing? How can you not be willing to spend? I'm like I'm I know it. I'm trying like it kind of makes it sound like I'm I'm just saying like five million is not that much money. I understand five million dollars is a lot of money. Yeah. But it could be the difference between you just making cost they didn't make cost on box office for iron giant i think they've since made cost they have to have because just yeah. with how big it is it's a huge cult classic but they they didn't make cost and they probably could have if they just advertised it properly and it's just such a small it's it's such a small investment against that it's so weird that that you're that you're willing to make this this other huge investment but then get scared of investing just a little more and risk that it will make it on its own merits despite the fact that you think it isn't good enough to merit the advertisements exactly. why, why like it's so it? paradoxical it's fucking dumb that's, a, that's, a, <laughs> that's that yeah that's I, I give the performance of the marketing execs for Iron Giant and Captain Underpants a <laughs> out of <laughs> 10 <laughs> Yeah, Captain Underpants also got like very measly, uh, measly advertising. I wonder like, how I much one trailer. I wonder how much of it is Boss Baby, like how oh, much of it was they had shit set up, 
but then when Boss Baby took over its slot, they had to they had to cut a bunch of deals, and then maybe because of all the deals that they had to be cut, the, a large chunk of their advertisement b budget went Possible. went gone, and then they couldn't have advertised it as much for this time. I mean, I haven't seen Boss Baby, but like it can't it I can't saw, be better. I saw it, and it it was not. First of all, it just wasn't better. Yeah, it was not a better movie. It wasn't a bad movie. I would even argue that it was pretty all right. It was pretty good. I'd say I'd say Bo Boss Baby was like a six point five seven. I uh, on on this, I do my skill. I'm not used to that. It just it's weird for me. I don't like thinking of it in my head, and I don't know how to I don't know how to rate it anymore. Really, with seven being the average, I guess it would be like a seven point five eight, maybe. Okay. I right. with the seven as average thing. I don't know. But it's it's still it's it's pretty it's pretty alright. It's still it's still a pretty alright movie. I, but like, it's okay. it's nothing compared to Captain no. Underpants. No. Cap Captain Underpants was obviously crafted with love, and just from seeing the 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 advertisements for Boss Baby, I was I wasn't into it. I was like, it just seems like another anime. It looked cool. I, I wanted to watch it, it actually. Was a, I never saw it. It was a dumb premise that did not make up for its execution in the trailers in a way that made me think that it was going to be a funny kind of dumb. And I'm and I'm gonna be biased here in the in the display because I was gonna watch Captain Underpants no matter what. I actually didn't yeah. have, I didn't I didn't expect anything out of out of Captain Underpants. Me and Ricky talked about this. I hoped for everything, but I didn't expect anything out of it because if you try if you go into into like shit that you loved as a child expecting something out of it, you're just leaving yourself open to too much heartache. Too much. Um, it was it was a great movie and like, and this they, not only did they like. According to Billy, from from Billy's sources, um, did they replace it with Boss Baby on its release date? Yeah, they did. They did. They yeah. it was Boss. The, it was going to be in March, but then Boss Baby, I think, did better with like test audiences or, or something. Exactly. And so they they kicked out Captain Underpants and had and moved it three months down. Captain Underpants has been finished yeah. for 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 like four months. And 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 instead they released. Uh, fucking Cats Underpants alo alongside, alongside Wonder else? Woman. Alongside fucking Wonder Woman. Dude, um, just go I, I, out there and flop around it's, and die. it's a DC superhero movie, but it's Wonder Woman, which has it's been Wonder crazy yeah. hyped. Exactly. Like, I, I wanted to go see Wonder Woman, too. If Captain Underpants hadn't hadn't been playing, I might have gone to see Wonder Woman. Oh, yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, but, I, I but, I, but they put it up to next to Wonder Woman, which is a superhero movie. It doesn't even fucking matter how... If it's from DC. If it had been another... If it had been... Batman v Superman 2 it still would have overshadowed Captain oh, Underpants absolutely. because I mean, it's a superhero movie that's just, just the, the name alone of... should attract like taught like kids um but not not compared to Wonder Woman Wonder Wonder not Wonder Wonder yeah not just Wombo compared Wombo to superheroes Wombo Woman he she me Wombo, Wombo Woman <laughs> um he me she Wombo Woman she woman she Wombo Wombo she <laughs> the, the, the secret is just keep on saying jokes until either you say something funny or the repetition of the joke becomes so funny so here's here's Ricky's number one tip for let's play fucking don't don't be funny don't be funny, don't be funny ever funny. people will like it it's true stay, stay silent for like a really long time and it'll be I'm funny to you and your co-host but not anyone else <laughs> Um, oh, I like this level. It's, it's fucking sucks. How, how many times did you play that last level? Because I, I kept, I, I, uh, three times. I don't actually, I, I never realized, like, I, I would actually give Dan on Game Grumps, um, shit for this sometimes, because, uh, he just would never be paying attention to the fucking games, but now that I'm doing this, like, holy shit, I'm looking at this game, like, half of the time. Dude, I fucking pay attention to every fucking game you play. Right? I, 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 I don't know, I'm just, I, I'm used to more looking at people, like, it's hard for me not to. I suppose. You're so pretty. I'm a, a pretty, pretty, I'm a pretty baby boy, man. dude. Such a pretty baby um, boy. I'll read. Um, baby child, you're a child. This, uh, yeah, I had to replay it three times. There's two secret exits. Um, and don't get me wrong, I, I love I love the visuals, uh, but I I tend to mostly focus on changes of levels, like when like where I see themes change. Oh uh, yeah. Um, so like when you got into this, it's like. Also, by the way, this this is giving me some fucked up flashbacks to what I like my most hated area in WoW. In World of Warcraft, um, which was a, a sub area of the Barrens, which is did it just suck balls. Suck. It was the it was the suck. level, it was the level fifteen to twenty five area in WoW, yeah. which is is ju it's just a bad area in, um, the the kind of level structure of WoW, because anyone who's played it first first uh first level to tenth level in WoW, hyper engineered, fantastic. 
Like like even if you're not really into into MMOs, you'll play the first the the, the first to tenth level of WoW for your character and be like, you know what? I might be able to get into this. This might be okay. I I was like fuck it. I played for like a little bit and I was like. Well, how long fuck. ago did you play? Uh, middle school. <laughs> it's been a while. Big difference, dude. Like when I say I, you you don't even know what I'm talking about. Hyper engineered. The the like fully engineered plot lines. You're playing shit by yourself that you wouldn't think you should be able to do by yourself in an MMO. Like, you're like, this whole story is for me? This whole event that's happening right now is just mine? That's cool. Like, in, in the in the Death Knight uh, opening thing, which is the hero class, you start at level 60, um, you, you fucking start a war and, like, you, you rebel against uh, one of the most powerful characters in World of Warcraft lore and, like, break your bonds as a... As a as an undead knight that has been brought back to life because your 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 master's just too evil for your shit, Yeet. um, and and the whole thing is instance like you you fight the the fucking big bad of that expansion by yourself, in that in that in that expansion you you fucking get into a tank, you get into a steam tank and fight a giant floating necropolis, the and fuck, shit dude. like it's all like the first ten levels of every, of every fucking uh like background is hyper engineered and it's great it's so good it's so fucking good and then you get out of those hyper engineered areas and you get to like the normal game where the the like it's not like they didn't put an immense amount of work into it but it just naturally has to be spread out a little bit more and it just you you see more of what an mmo is all about yeah, sure. And it becomes more of a regular MMO. Like the first the the first 10 levels of every background it feels it's it's like a hybrid MMO just regular single player RPG. Like it feels it feels like man, is this will I get this kind of feel where I feel this important this whole game? And that's a a feck, no. <laughs> no. No. no I I've never been into those kind of games. I've always fuck, I've always been way more into um single player experiences. Single player like Oh fuck! Oh, cranky no! Cranky that's no! Cool. That's cool that you had uh, damage block that whole time. What's the term for that? Oh, um, damage boosting. Thank you. Yes. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Thank you. Oh shit! I think we just beat this world. Really? We. Damn, that was fast, I. Ricky. Uh, I'm gay. Good job. Makes it gay people great at DK. It's because it's because Deke sounds like Dick. Fuck man. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's I think the most I could <laughs> I'm, prou I'm, I'm proud of you because like you've been working pretty hard to carry our commentary these past. Well, it's years. mostly it's <laughs> mostly just been shit that I've been like I'm. It's really easy for me to just keep. Yeah, well, I just about. mean like I'm all I'm like si like also, you you are in the mode where you're chatty and I'm not. Um. So I have nothing to say. <laughs> it's like either don't, both of us have nothing to say, so we're just like, <laughs> <laughs> like that was pajama uh, save. That was all yeah. pajama save was. <laughs> I still love it though. No, that's what like, I'm saying. I, that's I good. really yeah. feel like we've gotten a lot better. Dude, we've should, gotten so much we, better. We are so fucking good. Like Ricky I, and I have gone back to to listen to our to our first two Zelda episodes and like fuck us, fuck, fuck, fuck us, Zelda dude. us, yeah, and we, that was only like three months like, ago. Like at this moment, we are like fucking deities, dude. Like, fucking step to me, I'll fucking cream you with we're, my cheeks. We're the perfect Let's Players. We yeah, are yeah. the perfect Let's Players. No, we're gods. Players. Like, we're skyscraper-sized gods. I Cutie will pie, smash you with my that? butt cheeks. Who dat? Who dat? Baby, I, G, G, Y. Who dat? Who dat? PewDiePie. Pew, 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 Ricky, I'm kind of hungry. Is there anything to eat? My asshole. Did you see what we just unlocked? Is this a bonus level? It's the fucking bonus level. Oh shit! It's the fast forward. I'm going to figure my own asshole for for 45 minutes level. Mm. Woo. Let's not do that whole fast forward thing, dude. You don't need to do that. You don't need to be that guy again. Oh. Like I think you should have a start and then maybe one or two like hot takes and then and then a. Yeah, I'll probably. Uh -huh. yeah.